When we go to Chicago, you know what we're going to do? No. We're going right straight to Marshall Field. I'm going to buy you the slinkiest, meanest, laciest oh. evening gown they've got. <laughs> Price, no object. Yeah. And when I put it on, we're all set to step. Who put one of his jealous fits and locked the door? <laughs> oh, no, no more of that stuff. You wait and see. <laughs> I'll take you any dance place you want, and we'll have fun, the both of us. You know what I'm going to do? <laughs> I'm going to take some lessons. They tell me that Arthur Murray in six hours can have you doing the rumba, the samba. <laughs> <laughs> Georgie, this is quite a change. What brought this on? You know what? <laughs> it's getting late. I'm having my slip. No, I hate to move. When we have a fight and make up that way, I... Never want to leave your side. <laughs> Give me some more shoes, Georgie. <laughs> you know, I'm sorry we're leaving today. Just as well. Wish we'd brought the car. Driving home, we can take our time on the road and stop any place we please. Well, what are you getting all dressed up for? I'm going to pick up the bus tickets. Pick up the bus tickets? Well, buy them when we get to the terminal. I'm not going to stand all the way to Chicago. I want reservations. Well, there are no reservations. We just go early and get aboard early. You're getting all dressed up to go out and buy tickets. Why? Where are you going? Here we go again. All right. I'm not going to the bus station. Does that make you feel any better? You smell like a dime store. I know what that means. Sure. I'm meeting somebody. Just anybody handy. As long as he's a man. How about the ticket seller himself? I could grab him on my way out. Or one of the kids with a phonograph. Anybody suits me. Take your pick. Okay, okay. So I don't know this guy. This guy you sing to, hum to. Uh, Build your Maxwell. I'll be back. <laughs> 